everybody this is av and i'm coming to you today with another collective haul like i said i'm pushing these hauls out um this haul i'll be having showing stuff from the beauty supply store a couple things from mac and the main thing is from inglot um i recently went on vacation in miami had a ball and i was able to stop in the inglot boutique and pick up some things so i'm gonna get started because i hate long introductions so first, I'm going to show you some things I got from Rite Aid. Rite Aid was having a sale on some Black Radiance products. So I wanted to, um, so I needed, I just wanted to try out a few of their products. So the first thing that I got was their Continuous Cream Eyeliner. And this is in Classic Black. And it was a dollar off. So I think it was like $2.99 with the dollar off. I've been needing um, some black gel liner. They didn't have any at Inglot, and that's what I really wanted, but they didn't have it, so I had to pick this up. And then I also picked up a perfect perfecting eyeshadow primer. I heard some good things about these, and I'm always willing to test out new products for myself and also to put in my kit. So I haven't tried it yet, but I heard these is a really good product. And last but not least, I did pick up the Black Radiance Eye Appeal Lasting Mascara. And I do have on this on now because I don't have any falsies on. And I really, it was really cool. cool. This is in black because look at the um, brush. It's really small. So I've been, I use this with this in my volume, my, um, volume voluminous, volume, voluminous mascara from L'Oreal. And these two together are just perfect. So. And like I said, everything, I don't remember how much everything costs, but um, check out your local Rite Aid. And all of this stuff was a dollar off. And now on to the beauty supply store. Um, I was going to the beauty supply to see if I could find those J-Cat lip paints, but I haven't been able to find them. And I'm not trying to pay $4.99 for each one because there's a lot of them that I want to get. So I saw that they had some new Ruby Kisses products. So um, this has been out for a while, but I did get, and I have it on now, is the uh, Aruba Blue uh, Lip Lacquer. And this is super pigmented. I love how it looks. I'm glad I stepped outside my comfort zone to get this. So this, I could pick this up. I also, they had, and the new products that they had was um, the Pure Mineral um, Concealers. And so I got picked up two to um to kind of test them out so i got light beige because i thought i was going to be able to highlight with this but it's super 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 light so what i'm probably going to have to um, do is mix this with another one and they have a doe foot applicator but i think this is also good if you're a makeup artist because i love um ruby kisses you can still squeeze it out on a dish so you won't um get you know um to keep things sanitized and then I also got medium, which I use today to clean up my brows. So it's cool so far. It kind of reminds me of, um, they have so many different shades. And I mean, they have it for your super light girls to your super deep tones. And so this one is the light and this one is the medium. So I'm still testing them out, but it seems pretty cool. And I also picked up, I've been on a BB cream kick. So I picked up the BB Beauty Balm. It's oil free lightweight and even skin tone and i got it in golden honey and i have it on now and it's cool the only thing i hate about this is it has a horrible smell i hate scented foundations concealers all of that i just don't like scented stuff because like it gets it, it kind of irritates my skin but i'm liking this so far um i've also heard some really good things about it so um i'm still testing it out because y'all know i love my aqua bb cream uh this stuff is the bomb. So, yeah. So, I'm still testing this out. But so far, so good. I like it. Okay. So, now let's get on to my vacation stuff. Oh, no. So, like I said, I went to MAC. And I only got two things from MAC. So, the first thing that I got, I got a Good Kisser. And this is from the A Novel Romance Collection. And this is this is the only lipstick that I wanted, and it's pretty much a dupe of um, Pleasure Bomb, I think, from uh, one of the Riri collections. So that's it right here, swatched on my hand. And it's such a pretty color, and it's just a pretty fuchsia color. 
And then I also picked up, and this was, um, I pretty, pretty much should have got the bigger one because it would have been this, pretty much the same thing with my Pro Discount. And this is the MAC uh, Pigment in Rose. Ladies, gentlemen, and all those in between, this pigment is so gorgeous. Oh my gosh. I'm going to do a quick swatch of how pretty this is. It is like duochrome. I did this with a look. You can find this on Instagram that the look I did. And when I tell y'all, girlfriend, I was beat. My eyes was looking good. And I added a little bit of matte glitter with it. It just looks so nice. So this is the smaller travel size one. And it's only 10 bucks. So yeah. So now on to the Inglot stuff. So I picked up some pigments, an eyeshadow palette, and a blush palette. So I'll start with the pigments. So I got, let me take this out too. So I got four pigments. So one of the pigments is like a body pigment, pigment powder. So I think you could just, you could use this on the entire body, just not the eyes. But they also have a, this, um, a little sheet in here to let you know which body pigments are not used for the eyes. But this one you can. So this is pigment 156, and the only, that's one thing I hate about Inglot. They don't have names to their products, so you have to remember the numbers. So, and they don't have shifters too, so that's what it looks like. I'm not going to do any, I might do swatches, but it could get really messy. So this is the body pigment in 156. Um, then I got uh, eyeshadow, everything else is eyeshadow pigments. And these are so gorgeous. Like, I've been really loving the pigments. This one is in 24. And it's a pretty kind of gold color. So, that's it right there. Oh, no. I spilled some out. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to have to clean it up. Oh. The next one is 82. So, I definitely got to be careful when showing y'all. <sighs> but it didn't spill that much. And this is the another kind of copperish gold color. I love gold pigments. It just looks like you have gl <sighs> glitter on your eyes. It just looks so nice. <laughs> and then last but not least, this is 85. And this is definitely a dupe for Max Blue, Blue and Brown pigment. pigment. And this is what it looks like. Look at that, y'all. I'm going to have to do a, um, it's not acting right, so yeah. Can't wait to use these in some upcoming looks. And then I got two blushes. I didn't want to buy a, a blush palette. I didn't want to get a blush palette because then that would have been, it would have been cost more and I only wanted two blushes. So what I end up doing is getting one of their pressed powder palettes and then putting the two blushes in here. So I put the numbers down here. So I got 63 and 66. And when I tell y'all, look at this. Look how pigmented these things are. And I've had both of them on now. And I just used them really lightly. I kind of mixed it. Perfect fall colors. Look at these, y'all. So pretty. And I'll make sure I have these in the link below. And this is the palette. I like the palette. It is a little heavy. And you could just do that. Snap back. And then um, I did get a five, um, five pan um, palette. And I was going to go to the other angle lot. But I didn't have chance to, a chance to go. So I got five shadows that I normally don't have. So, I got number 8. This is 464. This is 51, a gorgeous orange color. I got this gorgeous number 17 in green. And number 38. And this 38, y'all, look at that. So gorgeous. They got pigmented. And they're so soft and buttery. This orange is nice, too. And this um, light kind of champagne is a very nice color as well. 
and that's right there so yeah this is my inglot and um this is my haul that's all i got um like i said i did want to get the 77 gel liner that everybody talks about but they were sold out so if you have any questions about anything please let me know and i'll be i'll make sure i have links because you can also get ink lot stuff from beautylish so i'll make sure you have that link and i'll have everything in the description box because i've been making sure i put that stuff in the description box so i hope you um you have a good holiday it is labor day today and i just wanted to make this video so make sure you thumbs up you subscribe and you share Peace.